Hey guys, how are we all doing? Welcome back to the channel and well, welcome to a, a special and kind of a sad day at the same time. We have brand new Hollow Front music. Now, if you're not familiar with the band Hollow Front, they are a dual vocalist band. You have the harsher screaming vocals in Tyler and the clean, deliciously heavenly vocals from a guy called Dakota Alvarez. Now, this band are a band I've been a fan of for a very, very long time. And unfortunately, uh, sometime last year, I think it was, uh, Dakota, the clean vocalist and guitarist, decided that he was going to step away from the band. Um, he is just an amazing part of this band. He will be forever missed. Now, they have released this single, or they will be releasing this single. I have got, obviously, the uh, the early release shout out to UNFD for the hookup. And it is one of two singles that they've managed to record with Dakota before he left the band. It is called Letting Go. Now, I believe this is a visualizer, so we will just probably get the album artwork or the single artwork for this. But yeah, it is one of two singles still out there that have been recorded with Dakota's vocals. Um, I'm gutted that he's left. I understand and completely agree and support his reasons for leaving. But this band are special and there's big shoes to fill with the exit of this guy so we will stop talking we will get into this we'll get the headphones on and we will transition over here we go it's called letting go hollow front let's do this This sounds like it could be a sad one, you know. Screaming turns to tears and now we're full. There he is. Heartbeats racing, I can let it go. Oh man. Oh, ho, ho, ho. oh ho, ho, ho. This sounds so fucking chunky, man. Little pitch thing. Oh, we didn't drop. I thought we were going to drop. Man, them vocals. Find an alternative woman. Beta, get the third base. Play this. Get the white rug out. Put some Dakota on. I'll tell you what, Dakota's got a lot of vocal on this track. This is why I fucking love music. Mm. 
哇！我 tell you what. I tell you what. Trains. I like trains. I tell you what, people. That's a that's a fucking that's a track of the year contender right there. That is a fucking track of the year contender right there. This band are very good. They've always been very good. That. Probably their best track to date. And that's a big statement to make with this band because they've got so many fucking good songs. Dakota took more of a lead vocal approach to that. Usually he does like a verse and back and stuff in the chorus and normally Tyler is the one heavily with the screams. Oh man, I'm I'm kind of even more gutted that he's leaving now because Like you know I'm you know what I'm like, I'm honest and stuff and, and I do always wanna portray opinions in a nice way and stuff but i honestly don't know how this band continues without dakota because he's such an integral part you've got his guitar playing but you've also got his vocals it, in effect they've lost two members of this band and that's not to say that there's some fucking phenomenally talented people probably just waiting in the wings for the invite to join hollow front but they are big big shoes to fill people they really are um i i wish the band all the luck in the world it would be a fucking sad sad day if the band announced that they were splitting up and not making music anymore that is not what i want at all that is not what i'm trying to say i just think that that is a massive massive gap left to fill whether or not you get a guitarist in and then a clean vocalist and balance it out with the two of them but trying to find someone that can play like Dakota, but also sing like Dakota. He is fucking unique in what he does. His voice is phenomenal. Um, guitarists are easy enough. I mean, they're not. They are and they aren't. It's the same with vocalists. There's so many out there. It's that sound. Hollow Front have such a unique, clean vocal sound in Dakota. And some of his guitar playing as well is so crisp and clean. And there'll be thousands and thousands of guitarists out there that can easily play his things because they're going to have to tour whether or not they use Dakota's backing tracks as, as, the, as the song instead of him physically being there or someone else comes in. We could be pleasantly surprised. We could be blown away and get the next Dakota. I mean, I would love nothing more from, you know, one day Dakota to just go, fuck it, let's just come back and give it another go. But at the same time, I agree with all of his reasons. The statements out there, it's nothing dodgy, it's nothing bad. He didn't leave the band for anything bad. Um, it was just overwhelming and stress-related. Um, and obviously, they had an accident and things like that, the band. So I completely agree with his reasons. It's just when, when a member of a band leaves and then they're replaced, you can be like, okay, yeah, that works. This might happen with Hollow Front, but like I've said, and I will keep on saying... Dakota doesn't just leave a gap. It is a fucking canyon of a space that he has left in this band. And it's a challenge. It really is a challenge. I look forward to seeing what they do. I look forward to hearing new music. I, like I've said again, I do not want this band to split up. They are very fucking special and I love them to death. But that is a that's a task. That is a task and a half to replace someone as good and as talented as Dakota Alvarez, and I think a lot of Hollow Front fans will agree with me, but if you don't, or if you do, leave it down below in the comments, and we will have a discussion, but as for that track, that is fucking phenomenal, that is probably one of the metalcore tracks of the year, by far, so, there we go, we will leave it there, people, thank you very much for watching, appreciate the guys at UNFD for the hookup as well, um, you're probably watching this at around 5, 6 o'clock UK time after possibly a video is being released i'm not too sure if there's a music video for it um but yeah i'm obviously not going to go against the wishes of the band or the label and release it early 
So here we go. I just got a chance to record it so I can drop it as soon as it goes live for you guys to enjoy. Link is in the description. Go and check out the original. Leave some comments. Show some love to the boys. Um, and yeah, I will see you all on the next one. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye for now.